Holy crap, I'm here already. Oh, all right. Well, well he's pissing me off. Well. <laughs> wait, wait, hold on a second. Uh, hello, Paul. Yeah, hi, nice to see you. Yeah, good to see you. What the hell was that song you were playing? Just li li you know, Live in the Vida Loca. Oh, well, uh, gracias, senora. Whoa. <laughs> Ole! <laughs> so, Walter, uh, you've been looking forward to this. Oh, sure, I love this show. I love Dave. Really? Yeah. Why? I don't know. A couple more years, he and I are going to look exactly alike. <laughs> what about Paul? We already do. Why? Why I oughta? Oh, shut the hell Why up. Why you? You don't have a jacket like this. Yeah, I'll kick your ass. I mean, how are you going to get over there? <laughs> Just throw me. Uh. <laughs> so, Walter, I uh, understand your wife's in town. Oh, yeah. She having a good time? She always has a good time. It pisses me off. <laughs> She's a lovely lady. Well, we're in New York, and since we're here, for some reason, she thinks we should have sex. Well, it's the energy. It's my nightmare. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. Well, you got a good love life? Yeah. Sex? <laughs> With your wife? <laughs> yes. Yeah, in fact, it's uh, good for her. Yes. In fact, sometimes she calls me the, the hurricane. <laughs> the what? <laughs> The hurricane. Oh, yeah, I get it. Exciting at first, then it ends in disaster. <laughs> Maybe she should call you FEMA. <laughs> All right, and what is that? Slow to respond and not a lot of satisfying results. <laughs> So, uh, we had a nice flight in. Oh, yeah, well, you did. Huh, me, we get on an airplane. I'm his carry-on, for God's sakes. I go in the x-ray machine. I'm gonna have cancer tonight. <laughs> Why don't you tell him what happened? All right, so we're going through Chicago. Yeah, Chicago here. Yeah, we're going through security. I, I go through the x-ray. I come out the other side. I hear the guy say to Jeff, Sir, I gotta look inside your suitcase. Yeah. Uh, 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 this is all true. Jeff's standing there. I'm lying in there thinking, Ah, oh, crap, here we go. The guy opens the case, I popped up and I go, Hey, shut the damn door! <laughs> Scared the crap out of the guy. Well, they gotta have the tight security. Yeah, I know that that uh, no liquid thing's a pain in the ass. Well, they do that because those potential terrorists were caught trying to smuggle on explosives inside shampoo bottles. <laughs> yeah, there's another group of folks I don't understand at all. What, them damn suicide bombers? Yeah. Good God, what the hell is this? Yeah! <laughs> Way to go! Bet you can't frickin' do it again! <laughs> You know, Walter, those guys actually believe that if they martyr themselves like that, there'll be 72 virgins waiting for them in paradise. Well, ain't the fool, dumbass! <laughs> If there are virgins waiting for you, it'll be 72 guys, just like you! <laughs> Seventy-two virgins. Why not seventy-two slutty broads who know what the hell they're doing? Well, <laughs> yeah, I, I think we're in trouble now. Yeah, that'd be pretty funny. What? You see, you get your ass kicked by Ahmadinejad. <laughs> that killed last night, but he frickin' said it without moving his lips. <laughs> Say goodnight, Walter. You've been a lovely crowd. Thanks very much. And thanks, Paul. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. Jeff Dunham, ladies and gentlemen, and Walter. Thank you, Walter.